Yeah, I'm on the way down fishing again now this morning. Uh, it's uh, 6.30, so I'm heading out. I'm heading down the bay again this morning. I'm not sure what the date is, 24th or something like that, 25th. Water is pretty well low now, so probably no good. And it's Sunday, so yeah. I don't have a look around. Wind is supposed to be 15. Might be okay, I don't know. Look around and have a draw anyway. Cod fishery is on. Yesterday was too windy. This morning now is, well, not bad. That's where I made it to this morning down there. Probably another scorpion. No, I was right. Another scorpion. As you can see, lots of doors. Time to go. And they are ugly. Ugly fish. Seems like lots of old scorpions there. Anyway, we got 101 feet of water, and there's no sign of fish down there on the, on the above the bottom anyway. A couple of small ones. That I'm never scoping. Lots of scorpions. Yeah. Right. He's wiggling fast, so probably a scorpion. But ain't no big codfish. I don't think. There's somebody over there this morning. In the boat. On the morning. Well, that's a very good codfish, not bad. Yep, keep it. Just barely at it. Sorry for a rounder. We call rounders. A rounder is a small fish that is. Cleaned, salted, and, and just put into the deep freeze. You salted a nice while and then put into the deep freeze. And, uh, and when you want to eat it, you just take it out and rehydrate that thing again and, and uh, cook it. You can cut it and boil it or do whatever you can have it for fish and brews or something like that. But, Anyway. Now it's down on the bottom and we got 117 feet of water and I've I got another, no I haven't, that was the bottom of my head. Now i got something out. Oh, it's a little bit bigger. That's a codfish this time, right? He bucks like a codfish. Yeah. A 
I'll get that into bulk. This is number 10. Five for me and five for Mrs. Yeah. A lot of small fish this year. Actually, I got that one. Oh, the gills. I don't know how good I got it. Oh no, I got it by the, by the jaws. He swallowed the hook. So, there he is right there. And he's not bad. Heading up home again. I uh, got my fish. And the wind has not even breezed up yet, so uh, I just thought I'd do can there now. Floor's been 20. Hot and cold, western. Yeah. It's uh, 9.30. In the morning, I'm on the way back home now. Uh, it's Sunday morning, uh, August. Yeah, those fish are in salt now for, uh, well, this is just one hour, so that's enough for corn fish, which is what we're going to do with those. I got some dried ones, and uh, actually, it's a bit too warm for that today, so. Yep, I'll wash those out now and put them in bags. Put them up in in uh, in pieces that we can uh, have for a meal. Two in a bag, probably. All I do with this is just knock the salt off and rinse it off in the water a couple of times. That's ready to eat. Actually, that stops it from uh, getting any salty earth. Nice fish. Really nice fish. Just the right size that I like. It's a bit cooler now. I'm going to do some uh, and dry it on a flake. You know, years ago they used to use bows for flakes, but I got some there. 30 by 30. Yeah, I use using my smoker, so I use those for smokers and for uh, Okay, that's it. I'll take that to the kitchen and do it up. Cut it in pieces. So now we got to cut all these up into meal size pieces, usually two or three pieces per bag, Ziploc bags we use, like that. So that's that. So we'll do some now. Got 19 to 20 bags. 19 or 20 bags. Yep, yeah, 19 or 20 bags. And for dinner today we got seal flipper. Hot, 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 hot. I better take new because these one lady vegetables go to the weight. Hot, hot, hot. Yep, seal flipper. Mmm, good. Another day on the old line, boy.